Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Um, <clears throat> sorry this is being done through phone. Uh, there is a reason for some thing that I can't figure out right now. Um, <clears throat> I don't have the time really to keep tampering and fighting with. I'm not really getting any sound on uh, OBS right now for recordings for some reason. So basically, until I can figure that issue out, I'll have to use other means and other methods. Hence the phone for today's opinion video. Um, so, the opinion video today is probably something most people just write off as, you know, unimportant or they just kind of accept and they move on. Um, but I'm noticing, and I've been arguing about it, especially more as through the housework of hell has continued. Um, when it comes down to it, sentimentality kind of can be difficult, is what I'm realizing. Now, there is someone who's probably going to be watching this video who's going to be like, You were referencing me, you jerk! And, yes, I am referencing you, but <laughs> not for the sake of being mean or to make you feel bad. It's more like, as this has gone down, I've slowly realized sentimentality can just make things harder. It can take a job that sounds like it should take no more or less than a normal person. Like, for example, purging and get rid of stuff. That ceases to be a quick job uh, with sentimentality kind of stomping in and saying, No, don't get rid of any of this. <laughs> Is what I'm realizing. And I'm starting to realize that, especially myself, there's... I do kind of get it because there are certain things like I... I don't think I can get rid of because they have too much sentimental value. But I'm also the, this mindset that there is desperate need to purge stuff. Now, is this video supposed to direct itself at that person? No, no, not at all. This is more just me kind of talking about the arguments now that I've been having with myself for, let's leave it at, too long. Let's say. Let's be kind and say too long. But I've started to realize that my sentimentality and my desire to purge are constantly going at this back and forth bit where it's like, purge, purge, purge. <laughs> and no, my stuff, my, no, no. It's a weird duality that honestly, in case anyone was ever curious, this duality is a little weird and complicated. Just a wee bit. It's a weird sensation of, I know stuff has to get gone. Stat. Because they're not going to get used, or because they're not very useful, or whatever have you. But, at the same time, though, as much as it can be, let's say, interesting to hear the arguments... Of the two different sides inside me. At times I wish they would both just shut up. I hate my dualities. I do. It sucks. Yeah. When it comes down to it though. I don't think this video is really about trying to give any advice or uh, say anything really useful towards people like myself who have that duality argument when it comes to purging and keeping. Mostly because I don't think there is anything that is a one-size-fits-all advice for this. It's more or less just a, which one has the better argument today? Whee! It's like a dice throw, kind of like. But the difference is, is stuff may get thrown away depending on that dice throw. And that's about the best way to put it. When I first started to make this video, I was thinking maybe I could use the arguments between my two sides and maybe come up with something that maybe might help someone else in the future or might make things in the future easier for someone or maybe help someone else who's going through something similar. And honestly... As much as I would love to have done that, I don't think I can. 
I would like to help with that kind of stuff, but I really can't. The only one who can really help you with those kind of problems, the, the argument between the two sides, is yourself, in all honesty. As much as that sounds like a cop-out answer, and believe me, it does, it's also very true. <clears throat> I can't help make the internal arguments you have easier. I may want to, and boy do I. I can't. I can't make them easier for you. That's something only really you can do. That is the overall arcing, the overall point of this video. Honestly, at first it was supposed to be about helping others who might be having that internal debate argument with themselves issue too. But then it more became about just making it clear to those people that they're not necessarily alone. There are other people who argue with themselves to death about such things. Some of us still argue to death about it. Now, next week is going to be another opinion video. After that will be a, a review after that Thursday. Um... There will still be Digimon Survive on Monday, even though it is cringy and awkward and voice acted in the most cringy, awkward way. And it won't end until the credits roll. Aren't you happy? <laughs> probably not. <laughs> probably like, oh god, he's still going with this shit? Someone kill him, please. <laughs> I hope, though, nonetheless, to see you all there, to see you at, uh, see you on Monday for Digimon Survive, where we can be weird, and where we'll crack jokes, even if they're perverted and weird, and I'm gonna be honest with you, if you expect me to leave this Digimon alone, and to not be pervy, or weird, or batshit, or inappropriate, or make horrible jokes... You and I haven't met well enough, apparently, yet. Uh, <laughs> uh, like I said, hopefully y'all are interested in that. Hopefully y'all are excited. I would have made a longer video or done a different topic video today, but the facts are is, like, in a couple hours, uh, Spectrum's supposed to be coming up in here to try and fix the internet problems that I've been having for four years now. And they're only doing this now. So, yeah. Here we go. Let's see how that goes. Who knows, maybe I'll finally have decent internet speed here. Yeah, I know, that's probably being too optimistic. <laughs> I hope you guys laughed at me, laughed with me, got some good jokes out of my expressions. Maybe you're all laughing your derriere off about my technical problem that's only happening now for no good reason. And I've checked my properties on everything multiple times and I couldn't get anything to friggin' function. Ugh, which just, just great. <laughs> I hope to see you all next time. See ya.